I've just thought about every single day. I mean, you've got to move on. You've got to ignore things to get to the where you've got to be. No. Not at all. I'm going to teach you totally the opposite. <laughs> Never ignore a single thing. Because it's the law of attraction at operation telling you what's wrong. If you need a job, you're employed to do a job and you've got to get there to do it. You've really got to ignore the distractions to... But you're allowed to cry at your job. You just don't think you are. <laughs> Well, you could. There's a consequence. <laughs> so then, therefore, the unresolved emotions towards the end of your human existence in this body, what happens with that? They, they are all still within you when you pass. You do not lose your unresolved emotions when you pass. They remain within you in your existence. All of your memories, all of your unresolved emotions. Today we are going to talk to some spirits who have had fear, for example, in them. And when they passed, they had that same fear. And they spent many years in the spirit world, still in the state of fear. Right? So you will not all of a sudden have this fantastic epitome. And all of a sudden, there's all of these emotions that you're holding on to right now are not going to be gone. The truth is, what's going to have to happen is you're going to need to choose to actually feel them. It's a choice. Once you get through to the next slide, are you able to resolve those here unresolved emotions? Or is yes. that why you have to come back? No. Okay. You, in the spirit world, you are perfectly able to resolve all of your unresolved emotions here. Right? So there is never any... And in fact, when we talk about, when we talk about reincarnation, you will see there is no need to come back to experience your unresolved emotions. Today we are going to talk to some spirits who have dealt with their unresolved emotions and not had to come back to earth to do it.